Drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel in the next 5 seconds if you guys want the new Galaxy Pack in today's item shop for absolutely free. You guys, welcome back to the channel and in today's video we're going to be going over the Fortnite Live event for Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 3 and we've got a lot of juicy information in today's video, you guys don't want to miss out onto it. But before we get into the video, if you guys are picking anything up from today's item shop, we still have the Galaxy Scout in the item shop and we have some new Summer Splash skins. If you guys are picking any of these up, make sure you are using my Sport credit code, examples 56 in the item shop shop as it does help me out a lot and it does help me out do giveaways for you guys so make sure you are doing that but let's get into the video so boys and girls around this time we start getting information for the live event for the season in fortnite and this season is quite interesting there's a lot of cool stuff going on obviously yesterday the water level dropped to the final stage which did introduce atlantis to come into the game and the spaceship which we're going to be talking about in today's video what actually you get from the spaceship and some interesting facts about it which is quite interesting we'll be talking about the seven if you guys don't know what the seven are make sure you are watching to the very end of the video but first off getting straight into things obviously we have a live event every single season but they didn't have a live event at the start of this chapter i'm not sure why they didn't do that obviously in the last chapter they didn't have a live event on the first season but then they introduced it on the second one which i think is pretty peculiar but we have got a lot of space vibes from this season obviously if you go into the battle pass right now if you go all the way to the end i'm pretty sure it's around tier 80 or something yeah exactly tier 80 you get cyana i'm not sure how say a skin but as you can see it is an astronaut skin which i think looks pretty insane i'm not gonna lie we have and we've had astronaut skins in the past from season three last chapter which is quite peculiar really how we're getting more astronaut skins within season three and then next season was all space themed obviously we had omega we had carboid just crashed down into the map and from a meteorite and obviously we've got the like starting image of season three and in the top left kind of area there's cyana with the spaceship that is in the game right now standing on top of an asteroid like a meteorite which is pretty peculiar i'm not sure what what's going to be happening but we do have a lot of space stuff going on within the game right now obviously yesterday the water level did drop and we did get to see the new spaceship within the game if you go to the top right of craggy cliffs you can go into the spaceship and then you can like complete a load of challenges to get a load of xp but once you completed those challenges you can start a launch sequence and once you have the launch sequence activated the ship starts to like activate and it shoots up into the sky which makes a massive Massive, like massive blast in the sky but doesn't make a rift so it's quite weird how there's no rifts cracking in the sky when that ship went out maybe maybe some of the seven have actually found out of what to actually do like not to form a rift to like warn anyone but it did shoot off into the sky it made a massive like massive blast in the sky a massive star and then it was gone forever and it's possible this skin inside the spaceship could be one of the seven obviously we've had some of the seven before we've had we've got three skins so far we've got the visitor the female visitor and the scientist those are three of the seven the seven are like the mythical characters in fortnite who control what happens and stuff like that within the universe and it's possible the ancient astronaut within a side of the spaceship is a one of the seven obviously the seven are the mythical characters like i just said we're not sure what their plan is the, la the plan last season was to actually destroy the map because something was going to happen really bad so they got the meteor from the rocket the rocket came back they rebuilt the rocket and they like moved the meteor to go straight into the zero point and kaboom it hey presto we have no more map and and that is when chapter two was born. We've got an awful map this chapter. I really don't like the map. But now we have new POIs. Atlantis came in. Obviously, that's for the season secret skin like POI. It's nothing to do with the live event. This live event area is for the spaceship. The spaceship did grant you a load of challenges and it did just shoot off into the sky. We have no, no information of what's actually going to be happening. But we do have some pretty cool teasers. Obviously, like I said at the start of the video, we do have this Cyana skin standing on a meteorite right next to the spaceship, which looks like what she came down in we had to repair the ship to get her male counterpart skin to actually get back into the sky back into deep space to tell us what's actually going on because we have no idea what's going on we don't really know why he came but we will be seeing some new information within the update on tuesday maybe or next week because we are super super close for more live event obviously last season around this time we got a load of doomsday device like event leaks and stuff like that so we're going to be seeing a lot more interesting stuff if it's possible it's going to be called the astro event or deep space event we're not 100 sure what it's going to be but it's definitely going to be space themed because they wouldn't drag astronauts back down into the map for no apparent reason there's obviously a link here within space 
and a lot of people did like the space theme last chapter in season four and season three a lot of people did like the space theme obviously we've got dark voyager and stuff like that we got all those cool skins but now we're going to be seeing some more space skins obviously the ancient astronaut is possibly going to be one of those secret skins it might even be a tier 100 skin for next season which is going to be pretty interesting i'm quite excited to see what actually does happen with this new ancient astronaut skin and what happens with all of the new stuff but make sure you are going to the new spaceship within the map right now because you can get yourself a lot of xp so as you guys can see here we, we are by the astronaut ship and we are literally just right next to craggy cliffs you come over to craggy cliffs you can see this new astronaut ship and if you go over to it it will start the process of the challenges you can do this in battle labs as you guys can see inside there that is one of the seven the ancient astronaut as i was on about as you guys can see i am in a default skin but if you go over to this rock here this is where you can find the first part for this if you go under this rock you just need to move around to actually find it it was there there right you just need to collect the battery pack and then you need to go and put it on the ship we'll go and collect all three parts but once we put this on the ship you do need to go and get the second part which is in the mountain so as you guys can see over there that is where the next part is it's glowing for you really you can do these in any order you don't need to do them in any specific order and you can collect more than one at a time so we're going to need some materials which i do already have so you literally just want to build up to this and then you can just go and collect this new part it does make a weird sound effect for some reason so you can literally just go and get this collect that missing part and then you can go and get the next one obviously like i said you don't need to do these in any specific order so as you guys can see over here this is where the last part is just below these rocks over here and then you collect all these and as you can see you get 14,000 xp for completing that challenge and that's just not all the xp you can get so you want to go over to this spaceship obviously you guys probably know about this already but we have some interesting stuff once this launch sequence does begin so you're going to want to add all these the thruster goes here obviously just install the thruster oh my controller man it's actually so broken there we go the thrusters on and then you want to install the heat shield as well as you guys can see another 14,000 xp and this is where you launch the ship obviously you can launch a ship and stuff like that as you guys can see the ancient astronaut is in there we're going to quickly launch the ship and then we'll be able to see some magic challenge start challenge event started as you can see we did get one step of the thing and this is where the cool stuff begins as you guys can see there's a force field around here now so nothing can enter to disrupt this like this launch sequence for this new cool alien ship the free thrusters are like charging up and we do have a little bit of time we have 40 seconds left as you can see in the top left As you guys can see, the spaceship has just shot off and then it blasts into the sky like that massive pulse of energy, like I said. No rifts were formed, unfortunately, but there were rifts standing around here, which kind of does indicate that we're going to be seeing some more rift action within the next season. We're going to be seeing some more space themes, but that is some cool information about the spaceship. We have no indication of where it's gone. We just know it's been shot into the sky and you can use these rifts, obviously. They are there every single game now once you have completed these challenges. And you guys can actually stop the like spaceship shorts launch. So when someone's actually activating it, you just need to kill them. And then that challenge is completed as well. You get another 4 14,000 XP but you do get quite a lot of XP for completing that but as you guys can see Atlantis is just over there one of the new POIs within the map right now and I think it's pretty cool man it's one of the coolest POIs I've, I think it's really peaceful over there as well I'm not gonna lie it's very very peaceful but that is all the information we do know of of the new live event obviously we're gonna be seeing some space theme coming to the game we're not 100% sure if we're gonna be seeing an hour like a meteor come down into the game obviously Cyan is standing on top of one in the like the Logan screen of season 3 so it's quite it's quite peculiar what we're going to be seeing obviously we're going to be seeing the space theme because they wouldn't bring astronauts down into the map for no apparent reason so next season is most likely going to be space theme this live event is going to be so cool obviously the doomsday event was huge like it was super super sick so probably one of the best live events i've ever seen and now this one is going to be space themed which i really do like all the space theme stuff within the game so make sure you are staying tuned for the channel remember if you guys do want anything from today's item shop we do have the new galaxy pack still in the item shop and we have some new summer splash skins if you guys want any of that for free all you need to do to enter the giveaway is drop a like on the video subscribe
subscribe to the channel, put those post notifications on and drop your epic in the comment section below. But if you guys are picking any of them out for yourself, make sure you are using my supporter credit code XApples56 in the item shop as it does help me out a lot and it does help me out do giveaways for you guys. So make sure you are doing that. We will be seeing the cars update roll out very soon as well. We have some new information on that, which I'm super, super gassed about, bro. It's going to be one of the coolest. I'm super excited for it. Hopefully you guys are as well. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the video and I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace.